Shalom uvacha. Your brothers and sisters, how are you doing? Sky is gray, but uh, also a person, when he looks at himself at the mirror, he can find himself gray, at least he can think negative thoughts about himself. Why does blue make you happier than gray? Just you got used to it. Maybe you saw it in the movies, your parents told you that it's much nicer when it's bright blue or whatever. You know, the life of the Torah scholars learning in Beit Midrash can be gray, but the truth is that even in the most gray, grayer, in the most grayer day, you can find so much light. I know that even when I'm looking at myself and it seems so broken and gray and dark, if I'm checking really from inside what's going on with me, I have so much. I contain, contain so much. My soul. Here it is. You see me? Reflecting. My soul is shining. Even when the day is gray. Even in dark hours. The search for Hashem is a spiritual search. We need to find the light of our souls that is shining from inside. That's the main thing to understand and to get it finally. When you try to receive your happiness from the external world, from the sky, from the excitement, from the view, from the house, from the furniture, from the food, everything is external. So. It won't be an inner happiness, an inner joy, so it means that it will pass away like the physical world that is breaking, that is falling, that is being destroyed with time. Only an inner happiness, an inner joy, an inner satisfaction is an eternal one and that's what we need to look for. Always to look on the Pnimiyut, on the inner part, on the inner side of our life. Then you will find real happiness, true happiness. Happiness on being loyal to yourself, to be who that you are, to be proud of yourself, to be strong, to go with your faith, with your wisdom, with your talents, with your abilities, to become that person that is you, to find your true self. That's the real happiness. Like the Gemara is saying that the main happiness is when you cancel all doubts and you clarify for yourself the real path of faith in life and you know the Creator and you feel Him from inside, that's the complete happiness, the complete joy that we can achieve.